During the course of the day, at some point, the day-end processing routine will need to be performed, either early in the day to process the transactions from the previous day, or at the end of the day to process the transactions during the day, or possibly even in the middle of the night. In any event, this is the process that updates cost values for all transactions, unless you chose the option to update item costs during posting. It also generates the general ledger journal entries, again unless you chose to automatically update the accounting transactions during posting. Other processes that occur during day end include the creation of posting journals for transactions that have been posted, updating inventory statistics, and updating transaction history. Day end processing also performs processing tasks for the order entry and purchase order modules if they are being used. These include processing transactions that were posted since the last time day end processing was performed, activating and posting future sales orders and purchase orders that have reached their activation date, as well as update quantities on sales order and on purchase order. In addition, it removes quotes and purchase requisitions with expiration dates up to and including the session date when running day end processing. It updates salesperson commission sales and creates batches for accounts receivable that contain the invoices and credit notes from posted order entry transactions, unless you have the system generate these transactions automatically when you post. It also creates invoices in accounts payable from invoices posted in purchase orders. Day end processing also removes completed transaction details if transaction history is not being kept. And finally, it updates statistics and history in order entry and purchase orders. The time it takes to complete day end processing varies according to the speed of the server and the number of transactions entered since the last time the function was performed. When performing day end processing, many tasks within ACPAC will not be accessible. Run day end processing when users are not in ACPAC. Just remember that even if ACPAC is configured to automatically generate and update all modules when a transaction is posted, day-end processing is still a required step. Let's take a look at the Create Geo Batch icon.